Hi. Hi. Are you American? Yes, I am. Where are you from? I'm from Cleveland, Ohio. What's your name? I'm Mike. Hi. My name's Pete. What do you do? I'm a student. Where's Trafalgar Square? I think it's near Green Park. Where's Green Park? It's over there. How do I get to Leicester Square? To Leicester Square? Take the number 12 bus. Where's the bus stop, please? Go straight ahead. It's on the left. It's opposite the park. Pardon? It's opposite the park. Thanks. See you soon, Julia. Bye. Happy birthday, Maria. Good evening. A uh, table for two, please. Would you like this table? Can we have the table over there? Yes, sir. Can I have the menu, please? Here you are, sir. Thank you. Can we order, please? Yes, sir. What would you like for a starter? What would you like, Julia? Would you like the soup? It's vegetable soup. I'd like a salad, please. A tomato salad. What would you like for the main course, madam? Can I have steak and chips? No, I'd like fish with vegetables. I'd like... Uh... Roast beef? No, I'd like chicken. What would you like to drink? A glass of red wine, please. A glass of mineral water, please. What would you like for dessert? Would you like some ice cream? Yes, please. Can I have the menu, please? I'd like some apple pie with vanilla ice cream, please. I'd like some apple pie, too. Can I have some chocolate mousse? I'd like some apple pie, too, please. That's three apple pies, one with vanilla ice cream and a chocolate mousse. Can I have a cup of coffee, please? I'd like a coffee, too, please. And can I have the bill, please? There you are, sir. Thank you very much. This is a very expensive meal. This is a very good wine. It's a very expensive wine. A delicious meal. Thank you very much, Patrick. Are there any trains to Sheffield from this station? No, there aren't any direct trains to Sheffield from this station. Hmm. No direct trains? No. Take the train to Leeds and change there. Hmm. Is there a train at two o'clock on Wednesdays to Leeds from this station? No. There's a train at half past one and there's one at half past three. How often do they leave? They leave every two hours on weekdays. Is there a train to Coventry at ten o'clock? No, but there's one at half past nine. What's the time now? It's quarter to ten. Oh, no. When's the next train? At quarter past eleven.
What time do your family get up, Mrs Burns? My husband usually gets up at half past nine. Half past nine? I get up at 7.30. What time do you get up in the morning? I always get up at seven o'clock on weekdays. And what time do the children usually get up? The children get up at eight. At weekends, they get up at ten. I'm sorry. Can you repeat that, please? They get up at eight o'clock on weekdays and at ten o'clock on Saturdays and Sundays. What time do your children get home? Paul gets home at half past three and Joanna gets home at five o'clock. And what time do you have supper? The children have tea at five. Good. My husband and I have dinner at eight. We eat in the kitchen. What's the matter? This is my husband's room. Mr Burns usually has lunch in his room. Isabel, come and meet Mr Burns. Where are the children? Where's Paul? He's playing football in the park. He plays football every Saturday. And Joanna? She's out with her friends. Now, the children must make their beds in the morning. Yes, I understand. And clean and tidy their rooms on Saturdays. Yes. They must do their homework before six o'clock. And on weekdays, they mustn't watch television after seven. At the weekend, they can watch television until nine o'clock. Sorry? At weekends, no television after nine o'clock. Isabel, don't do that, please. You must be careful with the washing machine. Mrs Burns, can I invite a friend for next weekend? Of course. What's her name? His name is Paolo. He's Italian. He's living in London. Paolo? It's just for the weekend. Please, can I invite him? No, you can't. Please, Mrs Burns. No. I must go to the shops now.